how do you take traditional neighborhoods under traditional land use plans and where those markets go away, how to revitalize and reuse that land and encourage development and reinvestment in community. This strict requirement of having city planners tell you exactly what is best for the marketplace is not necessarily what's being used today in the marketplace. I mean, much more of this is a market-driven discussion of what is best for development, what, what does the market support, what will people invest in. The private sector should be a part of land use decisions. Having a community vision, having partners that are strong and uh, supportive to work together to build your community, and most importantly, having the courage to affect change. The courage to affect change. Sometimes it's easier said than done. But just because something's easier said than done is no reason to avoid taking action. When all things point to a need for a new direction, momentum can build on its own. Behind me, we have an opportunity and a need for true change that will enhance this community for generations to come. This is the opportunity to revitalize the village at Foothill Ranch. Brookfield Residential Properties is proposing a new high-quality infill residential community in Foothill Ranch. It will be located in the town center area, currently the site of vacant land and an abandoned dealership building. This area has failed as an auto center, but now has an opportunity as a thriving mixed-use district. It is evolving into a new identity known as the Village. The Village is currently made up of a variety of uses, a retail center, an abandoned Chevy dealership, the proposed Trumark home site, medical and dental offices, and a Mercedes-Benz auto dealer. Kaiser Permanente is underway with construction of an administration facility. Yet several areas of the village are dragging down property values, harming existing businesses, and preventing a full economic recovery from taking place. Amongst several unused or empty parcels, the abandoned auto centers are the biggest offenders. Although most properties have transitioned to land uses reflecting the new economy, three properties remain vacant, remnants of a failed auto center. We need to create a mixed-use, economically viable, vibrant village where people can shop, live, work, and play. The community will bring a wide range of home size and price points within comfortable walking distance of shopping, education, recreation, and transit opportunities. The neighborhood proposed by Brookfield will include 151 homes starting in the 300,000s. It will provide much needed first time home ownership opportunities for Lake Forest's younger generation. Although the community meets all of its parking requirements within its boundaries, 24 additional guest parking spaces will be allowed on the public street. There will be a new public plaza and park area located at the corner of Bake and Portola, promoting passive recreational use and pedestrian connectivity. The streetscapes along both Bake and Portola will be enhanced to complement land uses, topography, and public view sheds. The community will have a centrally located recreation and gathering area with amenities that promote socialization, relaxation, and community formation. This area is planned for outdoor living, dining spaces, pool and spa, and landscaped areas. These future residents will enjoy coming home to a beautiful, livable, and mixed-use neighborhood. Once home, a wide variety of community amenities are easily accessible by walking or biking. Families who live in houses buy, shop, play, pay sales tax, uh, enjoy the amenities of a great city, and that's why housing is very important to the economic prosperity uh, of, of your local communities. When cities think creatively on how to grow business and provide for their residents and the community as a whole, it's a win-win situation for everyone. This is what community building is all about, bridging residents and businesses together to get our economy moving, and we all thrive. So that's our goal, to create a unique and memorable community, one that will support and enhance the existing businesses in the area, one that will increase 
school funding to the local district, one that will increase property taxes over 900%, and finally, one that will breathe new life into an area that's been struggling for years. Please help our community achieve this positive change.